Known for her work with X-ray crystallography, which is the technique used to determine the structure of crystals, Dorothy Hodgkin worked primarily with biological molecules. Five years of work? Insulin. She was the third woman to receive the Nobel Prize. Hey guys. Hi guys, welcome back again to this channel. Yeah. We're going to be checking out top 10 British scientists who changed the world. Um, this is the first time ever reaction to this and if you're new on the channel, welcome. Please make sure you like, subscribe, and share these videos with people you think Please do share it. <laughs> Let's get right into the video. Modern life wouldn't be the same without these brilliant minds. Welcome to Watch Mojo UK and today we're counting down the top 10 yeah, British scientists who changed the world. Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. No, that's, I think that's the word, um, one of the best mathematicians yeah. in the world. Have you? Please, I mean, I think that's the best mathematician in the world because I think I've had um, um, less story about it. Forgive us if we're trying to like guess all this is. We don't normally teach history in this country. You understand? Everything we know is based on research, research. and you know, outsourcing information in the world. And that is why this world of reaction means a lot to us because we get new knowledge. This is an educational platform for us. Sorry for that pause, let's continue. <laughs> for this list, we've looked at scientists born in Britain whose work has changed human life forever. Number 10, Peter Higgs. You've probably heard of the Higgs boson particle and the Large Hadron Collider that was built to observe it. What you might not know is that the man that the actual particle was named after is actually British. Originally oh. from Newcastle, he is one of the six physicists that were responsible wow. for suggesting the particle might exist and kick-starting the entire process to prove their theory. In 2012, they finally announced that they had discovered the particle and the following year, Higgs was awarded the Nobel Prize in Physics. Number 9, oh, Alexander name. Graham Bell. Born in Edinburgh, Bell is not only the founder of American company AT&T, but also the inventor of the telephone. So you can thank this man for your smartphone, wow. even if he might not recognise it as the descendant of his device. Hired by Gardner Hubbard to experiment with ways to send multiple telegraphs along the same line, Bell was also given funding to explore his true passion, the transmission of the human voice. In 1876, from the comfort of his packed office, he demonstrated his invention by making the first phone call. Number 8. Dorothy Hodgkin the end, you've not know, gone, gone any further. Just these two people alone is what whatever I'm thinking about right now. National this, treasure. This like, two oh, alone impacted. Created, created society. Yes. To be frank, I, talk about the particle, like discovering of the particle. I think that is actually what um, defines. I won't say it defines um, physics or science, but that is kind of like That's a bedrock of science. Yeah, yeah. Do you understand? And then talk about the telephone still being used worldwide. Now, currently. Do you understand? Yeah, I think you're watching us on the mobile. <laughs> <laughs> I can see you right I now. Guess so too. <laughs> but yeah, this, this is yeah. just so impactful. Hodgkin. Known for her work with X-ray crystallography, which is the technique used Actually. to determine the structure of crystals, Dorothy Hodgkin worked primarily with biological molecules. She was a pioneering scientist in the field of structural biology, and throughout her life she deciphered the structures of penicillin, vitamin B12, cholesterol, and after 35 years of work, insulin. She was the third woman to receive the Nobel Prize. I'm thinking what's in your head? Is it brain? No, these guys, they're not human beings. They're not human beings, for real. Oh, nice. To, she, she created penicillin, insulin. That is one of the most mind mind gold in in the current modern medicine today like i'm just thinking how innovative they are how thoughtful how they put their knowledge their minds to work i think i need to discover something first. we I think do I need, need to, to, yeah. <laughs> to change the world we need to broaden our mindset wow. prize in chemistry and to this day is the only british woman to receive the award for one of the sciences wow. number only seven woman. alexander fleming we're incredibly lucky that so many scientists have done the work to find cures and ways to keep us healthy. For example, Edward Jenner, who invented the first vaccine. But the one that made our list is Alexander Fleming, who discovered penicillin and paved when the I way for- the Fleming name, I wanted yeah. to say there's, there's a time I had a huge injury on my tongue. Remember that period? Yeah, 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 yeah. I used salt to wash my tongue. <laughs> so I had that injury and I was recommended to take Fleming. Wow. The drugs. I remember wow. the injury, just yeah. I didn't really because know the name. Because Fleming took the whole thing out, like, 
Wait, I thought the lady before was the one that actually no, invented that insulin. Pe- penicillin. She, she actually, no, she actually, she was actually in the radio graphic, um, Okay, yeah. okay, okay, okay. Wow. Way for modern antibiotics. Wow. Although he technically discovered it accidentally by having a messy office and leaving out cultures of staphylococci, there's no arguing with the results. In 1945, he was awarded the Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine, which he shared with two others. Number six, Francis Crick, James Watson, and Rosalind Franklin. London-born Rosalind Franklin used X-ray crystallography to better understand the molecular structure of DNA. Her pioneering work was then the basis for the work of Watson and Crick. Francis Crick is the British half of this duo, and together with his American partner, they discovered the helical structure of DNA. They wow. were jointly awarded a Nobel Prize for their discovery, guy, which also explained me. how information is transferred <laughs> inside your DNA. Sadly, since Rosalind Franklin had died in 1958, she could not share the honour. Hmm. Nonetheless, their discovery Why added significantly to our yeah. understanding of how living things work. What? Number 5. Alan Turing Born in London, Turing's work spread across several areas of study, but he is most famous for his work with computer science. He was hugely influential in the development of the study, so much so that he's today remembered as its father. If you don't know him from his groundbreaking work in computers, you might know him for his contribution to the British effort in the Second World War. He worked at the centre of Britain's code-breaking team and was responsible for helping to break the German ciphers, allowing allies to ultimately defeat the Nazis. Wow. Wow. Number 4. Tim Berners-Lee This is the scientist that you're probably going to want to thank the most because without him, we wouldn't be bringing you this video. Berners-Lee is the inventor of the World Wide Web. It all started with him wanting to find a way to share information between researchers. He built the software to facilitate this, and years later, spotting an opportunity to pair his creation with the internet, the pretty, mind-blowing online system that we all know and love today was born. Few technological developments have had such a clear impact on the modern world. Number 3. Stephen Hawking. With a long list of books to his name, including children's books, and a film made about his life, Hawking has had such an influence on mankind in modern scientific thinking that he has become a household name around the world. His most notable works are his study of black holes and his work in cosmology, which is concerned with the origins of the universe. All of his amazing essays, ideas and theories were made in spite of his motor neuron disease, which he overcame for decades, completely defying expectations. That guy is a superhero. <laughs> like honestly. His story is he's making me so emotional because he breaks all hearts just to Yeah, just to get what he wants. But and he was not limited he by wants, it. He he is oh course. Like I'm just thinking of what excuse do I have not to be Yeah. Hawking will go down in history as one of the greats, or rather, he already has. Number 2. Isaac Newton When you think of Newton, you probably think of the famous apple story. Although it's not strictly true, the apple didn't actually hit him on the head. He did claim it inspired his theory of gravitation. Like many on today's list, Newton also worked across several different fields of science, but he was most famous for his theory of gravity and the laws of motion. He's often considered to be the most influential scientist of all time, and wouldn't you know it, he just so happens to have been born in Woolsthorpe, Lincolnshire, England. Number 1. Charles Darwin Our number one spot is reserved for this incredible scientist because not only was his work hugely influential, but he also changed the way we viewed life itself. His theory of evolution completely rewrote history and demonstrated that all life evolves from common ancestors previous theories had tried to explain similar concepts, but Darwin's came with such convincing evidence that it was hard to argue against it. Scientists have gone on to gather even more evidence since then, and the fundamental concepts continue to hold up. Darwin's work ultimately changed the face of biology and our very understanding of nature. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo UK and be sure to with, subscribe with and ring of, the bell. This kind of invention they have um, actually created, I, I, I do agree with your pitch. Mm-hmm. You understand? Because these are groundbreaking inventions. These are mind blowing inventions. The impact is just. It's, it's too great to ignore. I think for the whole of the century, it's one of this generation and generations to come. They are still going to make reference to their discovery. Yeah. They are still going to learn about their discovery. Wow.
I'm actually mm. very inspired by how um, you taught the entire existence yeah. of TV, how to be very honest. Like, you didn't let the circumstances yeah. define the He wasn't thing. bounded by any physical thing. He, he rose above all. Oh, it's not really touching. And seeing the scientists, scientists alone from Britain, yeah. you guys, the country of Britain is just no any country because judging from their history, they have been they have been on the map since forever. Yeah. Really, and it's actually very inspiring to be honest. Um, let us know what you think about this down below in the comment section. Don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel. Also, feel free to use the links down there. We love you guys. See you guys on our next one. Bye, loves.